adjuster for such claims. Six, what, qualify, what qualifications are appropriate for a claims adjuster? Seven, what recommendation, oh, what amendments to Rule 12 or County Code might be appropriate? Eight, what is the Planning Commission's role, if any, in obtaining slash procuring an impartial, comprehensive geothermal <coughs> impact health study, as opposed to merely evaluating claims slash requests and determining whether to fund them? And I would request that that motion be made and that the information come back by the, the next um, Planning Commission meeting. So moved. Second. Second. Is there any discussion? Yeah, you know, I think it's um, uh, uh, with with all the community here expressing their concerns. I, I think it's important that we um, we move along and, and we require um, to get these answers by by the next meeting. Any other discussion? Yeah, I, I agree. I think the answers need to come out quick. I think for um, for the sake of, of, of perception of how we're doing this, because the process, I think it's very very important. Very important. I think. Many people have said this, that this needs to be done right. It really does. I think that the questions here will get us to that clear process um, and we'll be able to move forward in a progressive, comprehensive manner that will hopefully work for everybody. Um, but again, I would request that we do have the, the information by the next meeting and we could agendize it for the next meeting. Um, and at that point, have the clarity on exactly what to do, and then we'll know, and we'll be ready. And if, if need be, we can, um, once we understand what that claims adjuster looks like, um, potentially you know, put out a request for claims adjuster. Because obviously, the health studies are, are coming forward. What that exactly looks like, I think, will, will be determined over the next few months. But um, I think it makes sense to, to get that motion so we're not okay here's here, here here's a, a request for a health study now we need a claims adjuster and getting a claims adjuster is going to take another four months let's get this moving so we can, we can get it done any other discussion and uh, we can i can print this out for the exact exact question no other discussion so I think about Commissioner Al. Aye. Commissioner Gonzalez. Aye. Commissioner Ishibashi. Um, oh, I'm sorry. My, 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 <laughs> I apologize. Commissioner Moses. Aye. And Mr. Chairman. Aye. Mr. Chairman, motion to continue carries with four eye votes. Thank you. And so this will be agendized for our next meeting with Dan. Yes? Okay. Um, so that's it on um, this conversation right now. We'll be have to answer this next meeting and a clear process. Uh, when you provide it to us, uh, we made a part of the letter, um, uh, so we can provide that a copy to Ms. Patricia and uh, council members. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, so, number three on administrative matters. That is an application served by the Warren Planning Commission that are pending before County Council. Um, I apologize that I, I'm not as prepared as I should be on this particular matter, but I do have one announcement <coughs> uh, that the uh, uh, change of zone for uh, Donnie Souza and Melissa Mullican, which was that the zoning in Mountain View for the uh, automotive repair shop, um, that did pass council. So uh, basically, the property has been resolved. But uh, that's the only update I have to do. Okay. 